Hey, I'm Lester. And I'm Charlie. You know, it's been a year since we opened our booth, and uh, it's amazing. It's, it's, it's amazing how many people we've actually been able to help over that time. Yes. A lot of good times, and uh, good remember, times. remember that time when, when we were doing the first episode of Do It At Home America? We had to figure out the best way to show people how to bottle their own water. As soon as it starts to rain, and of course, that was a lot better than the first thing that we tried. When I get to the top, you throw me the water bottles. So we've met lots of amazing people in that year. Wonderful people. Uh, like, oh, like Michael Steele. Uh, right, right. Who came to us for help. Yeah, some guy, he, he, was, he was up for uh, some political position. Right, really and important job. And he was going to be facing some, some tough questions. Really tough questions is what he told us. And uh, so we thought, you know, who, who faces tough questions? Miss America. So luckily a friend of ours yeah. who was in the, in the pageant. And uh, so we went to her for some tips to help Michael. So here's my advice. First of all, they asked you about world peace. Well, of course you're for it. And not only are you for it, but you want to solve world hunger, too. And so you're going to make that your platform, and you're going to do it all within a year. And then if they ask you about gay marriage, well, that's a no-brainer. You know, every marriage starts out as a gay marriage. The first three years, the sex is great, and what's not gay about that? Then there was that tsunami. That was, oh my God, that was tragic. Oh boy, and the Red Cross was begging for blood. They needed blood, blood, blood. And there just weren't enough donors. But, you know, we went to Catholic school. Right, and we know there's a way to get as much blood as you need without using a single needle. Absolutely. It's, and it has got a name. Uh, trans... Uh, Transubstantiation. That's it. And it, it, it means turning wine into the blood of Christ. Right, so, so, so we got, we got a, a friend of ours. We got him to come to a liquor store and... Uh, Where well, you can do it in bulk, you know, you can turn it over yeah, we in got bulk and... As much as you could possibly we got need. We got liters and liters and but, liters. But, um, you know, the uh, Red Cross put up a good point, which was um, that no one knows what blood type Jesus was. Yeah, so. which, is, which was a problem, but... We had the foresight when we visited the Shroud of Turin to get... Um, a uh, little swatch. A Just, little bit. And, and our, our friends, the Pons Institute, did uh, they did uh, an analysis, a and DNA they, analysis. We found that Jesus was a Zinfandel. Yeah. Well, anyway, here's to a year. And and more people to save. Yeah, and you know, if any of you guys got a problem, you know where to find us. <laughs>